Good day, good day my fellow fans, today's royal installment. The first trailer of the highly anticipated documentary on the lives of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have finally been released by streaming giant Netflix. Shared on Twitter soon after midday, the trailer is the first look at the £88 million documentary series, which has been in production with the streaming site all year. A slew of personal photos are shared by the pair as the program makers hint what lies in stores for fans of the former working royals in the first look. Sad sound in cinematic piano music plays in the background to various black and white snaps of the couple out and about following their landmark decision to pack their bags for the US. Over the music, a woman can be heard asking, why did you want to make this documentary? Adding to the suspense of the clip, the question receives no immediate answer, but joyful, loved up photos suddenly turn to reflect hardship that the Duke and Duchess of Sussex have had to face. This is where the bombshell start dropping, with Meghan looking absolutely distraught. At the same time, Harry says, no one sees what's happening behind closed doors. It is the first time the public has seen the former Suits actor appearing to break down. In previous conversations, not least Harry and Meghan's interview with Oprah Winfrey, the couple have told how much they have struggled with the media and royal family over the last few years. Never before though have cameras captured their raw emotion, dealing with setbacks and negativity. Now though, as Harry says, viewers really are getting a glimpse behind closed doors. Meghan is seen in a black and white, with her head miserably planted in one hand, while holding a phone in the other as she sits cross-legged and leans forward. Dramatically, another bombshell can be judged to have been thrown up by Netflix, with the instant transition to Princess Catherine and Prince William. Still without colour, viewers are led to connect the dots as an upset Meghan turns to a stern-looking Catherine from the Commonwealth Day service at Westminster Abbey in 2019. Meghan appears sitting behind her. It seems to be a reference to the alleged row between the sisters-in-law ahead of Meghan and Harry's wedding in 2018. They were said to have fallen out at a dress fitting for the flower girls, with reports at the time claiming Catherine was left in tears. Meghan then told Oprah in her tell-all interview that it was she who was left in tears. The next shot is another black and white image of Meghan holding a thoughtful pose. Harry comes in again, this time fold on an armchair, telling viewers, I had to do everything I could to protect my family. Next in shot is him appearing to say goodbye to Meghan, who's wound the window down in the back seat of a car. As a young child, Harry could do little in the way of protecting his mum, Princess Diana, from press intrusion and her tragic car crash death. Viewers are reminded of his early years with stills of him as a boy growing up, including at his mother's funeral, which appears to have haunted him since. After a young Harry turns into photos of Meghan through the ages, the trailer shows the couple looking overwhelmed and vulnerable together. Meghan holds both hands to her face, wiping away tears as she closes her eyes on a sofa beside Harry, who looks to be in a state of distress, leaning back with his head aggressively rocked up. It is then the Duchess poses a cryptic question. When the stakes are this high, Meghan says off camera, doesn't it make more sense to hear our story from us? She is suggesting that throughout the series, a highly important issue is confronted and explained by them after various opinions and versions of the events spoken on by royal writers and commentators. Interestingly, not once in the trailer are the couple's children Archie and Lily but featured, which implies, along with the series' age 15 rating, that it far from makes family-friendly viewing. Netflix warns the six-part documentary contains language and discrimination. The streaming service also describes the film as a global event and says it is coming soon. Damn! Sounds interesting, I won't lie. What do you guys think? Are you keen for this documentary? Will you be watching it? Leave your comments below, like and subscribe for more and goodbye for now.